Hey YouTube, hopefully y'all can hear me. I'm at lunch, I'm break. Um, okay, I'm, I'm at work on lunch, I meant to say. But I was sitting here thinking, and I know what y'all thinking when I when I'm telling when I end up telling y'all, yeah, I'm like that's common sense, but it wasn't that common to me. I think depending on where you are um, in your life, in your mental state, um, determines a lot of what you do and or accept. Um, like the last situation that I was in, you know, I was all on here crying to y'all about it. And I think the reason why I ended up staying in that situation is because I felt like I deserved him, you know what I mean? And my own insecurities put me in that situation, such as, like, I didn't feel like, you know, people love me enough and people value my time. And thus I dealt with a guy who didn't love me enough and didn't value my time. So I felt like I deserved him, like, you know somehow subconsciously I began to feel that um, I didn't deserve these things and you know I was speaking that into existence into my life and that's what it basically became you know what I mean like I was telling myself that I didn't deserve uh, better or I think like, basically you just have to be mindful of the things that you're saying um, and because your life like, the world only hears the things that you say if you are like, man, I'm tired of this job, I don't want it, and then you lose your job, but then you don't have anything in place of it, um, or you don't have any income in place of it. I mean, you, you got what you wanted. Maybe not in the way that you wanted it, you know, you lost your job because, I don't know, you were doing, you got caught doing something at work you weren't supposed to do. And you don't have it. That's not necessarily what you wanted. You know what I mean? Not not exactly the way that you wanted it. Or I just want to I just want to be with somebody, and then you get with somebody that cheat or that gives you a disease or brings back a baby. You know something like that. You got you somebody, but not the somebody that you wanted. Like you didn't get someone who valued you, who wanted to uplift you and and get better and and you know gain more things with you. So really, we have to just be mindful of the things that we ask for. And look, this is what I'm eating for lunch I really need to stop doing that and y'all right now when I last weighed myself I was at 173 pounds so I definitely came a long way but I was just coming here just to talk about that uh, and I think the, the person I'm dealing with now like he um, gives me more attention more time you know and I mean because now I feel like man my time needs to be valued and I feel like he actually does value my time. So I feel like wherever you are in your mind is the things that you attract. You attract like energies. And with that last situation, it was really tumultuous. But he and I both couldn't let it go. But I think we both understand now that that's not. It wasn't the best place. And I think I, like I said, I valued him more than I valued myself. But also, he gave me the things that I felt that I had deserved. Like I felt like I didn't deserve. You know, well, not even that, because I felt like I did, but in my mind, these were the things that I was not getting, and so I attracted those type of things into my life. Um, hopefully, I can come back and speak without more. I'm probably going to have to do these more on my lunch breaks, um, because with the type of schedule I have now, it's like in the middle of the day. But, you know, like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think. Um... Hashtag whatever gets you. Uh, hashtag whatever gets you talking. And I'm still on Twitter, um, Kanye B nine. Um, so talk to y'all later. Bye.